ahead. Are you alright, my boy? No injuries, I hope. Don't worry, Professor, I'm fine. And yourself? Nothing a good long bath later won't solve, but more importantly, where are we? Ooh, there's that cog uh, symbol. The room is stuffed to the gills with curious machines. I've never seen anything like them. What do you suppose they do? What in the world? Look over there on the wall, Professor. My word! There are views from all over, or there are views from all over town displayed here. Don't they almost look like blueprints? What? What's this? Almost every villager's name is on this wall. Professor, what if somebody is using this place to keep an eye on what's going on in St. Mystery? Hmm. Look, there are stairs over there. Let's get out of here. This place gives me goosebumps. Yes, you're quite, quite right, Luke. Let's go or something. This notebook. Did you find something interesting? I think so. This notebook looks like someone's been using it as a diary. Just a little longer now. Soon this village will complete the task it was designed for. I've waited so long for this day, but as it comes closer, I feel a little lonely. I hope that, at the very least, the young mistress finally finds happiness in the end of all this. Our journal looks like it's been through a lot. All the pages are terribly frayed. I bet all the scraps of paper we found in the village come from here. Okay. I just want to reiterate that I have already guessed that everybody are robots. I hope I'm not proved wrong. What's this? You! You two again. What are you doing here? What are you up to? Just a moment, sir. What are you talking about? I knew it. You came here to steal my secrets, didn't you? Didn't you? Don't play dumb with me. I see right through you. Don't think I haven't been watching. Seen you two sniffing about every nook and cranny in town, getting in the way of my work. Now I've had it. So unless you want trouble, give me back number 38. Please calm yourself, sir. Just listen to what we have to say for a moment. We haven't intended to get in the way of your work. We're merely searching for the golden apple. Neither of us know anything about this number 38 business. Oh. Did you just say the golden apple? You're really here looking for the golden apple then? Precisely. Do you know anything that could be of help to us? Hmm, so that's how it is, eh? What you're looking for is on the top floor of the tower. Watch out, because the puzzles in this tower are harder than the whole mess of diamond tip drills. I know they call you a puzzle master, but are you sure you have what it takes to solve them? Now why would you go and tell us something like that? I bet you just w want to set us up to walk right into some sort of trap. What would I possibly gain from doing something like that? Not to mention it's my duty to guide those who seek the golden apple towards their goal. Some mischief maker snuck into the village and had me all confused, but I think I figured things out now. Seeing as how it's your duty and all, would you mind filling us in? What is Saint Mystery's big secret? All right. The name is Bruno. I work for the Reinhold family. Some time now, I've managed Saint Mystery from up here in the tower. Manage Saint Mystery. You're the one who manages the life of each of the villagers, aren't you? What in the world are you two talking about? Surely you must have seen them too, Luke. Do you recall the cogs we found about the village? And the list of names we saw in that room? All the villagers in Saint Mystery are robots created by Bruno. <laughs> Aw, oh, yeah, solved that mystery a long time ago. What do you mean the villagers are all robots? In other words, the inhabitants of Saint Mystery aren't human, but intricately constructed machines. They're robots, my boy. I have to say, I'm astonished. 
that anyone could build such elaborate machines in this day and age. You must be quite the engineer, sir. Oh-ho, aren't you a sharp one? I never imagined you'd figure out so much of the mystery by yourself. What do you mean, sir? Saint Mystery isn't a real town, Luke. It was constructed by Bruno and the late Baron. How am I doing so far, Bruno? Right on the money. Master believed that one day an heir worthy of his fortune would come forward. He had me build the city and all who dwell within it to prepare for that day. Then he hid his greatest treasure, the golden apple, away at the top of the floor of this tower. I was ordered to protect it with my life. Until the person arrives who can solve the puzzle of the golden apple, I will continue to protect it. Remarkable, I'm impressed how far Baron Reinhold went to protect his treasure. Not just any treasure, mind you, the golden apple was the Baron's most precious treasure. But why go through all this just to hide treasure? Why well, build an entire village to protect it? Uh, whoops, seems I've been a little loose-lipped here. I've already said more than I should have. The answers you're looking for are waiting for you at the top of the tower. Go on then, show me if you're the one who can solve the puzzle of the golden apple. I must say, we solved abductions too. Hey. Professor, look, the stairs are barred off. Ah, this must be one of the puzzles Bruno warned us about. It does look quite difficult. This is perfect timing, my boy. I'm in the mood for a puzzle with some meat to it. Here we go. Probably the last portion of this game. 70 Picarats. Yikes. Oh. Uh, this perplexing door has a device on it that contains a small red ball in the upper left corner. If you guide the ball to the hole in the lower right, it looks like the door might open. 21 moves. exact same situation I placed myself in last time. I need to get these out of here.
here not helpful not helpful at all What do I do with this block? There you go. Taking a time on this one. Then restart. Charles making plenty of progress. Okay. I 
that doesn't help me. The slightest. This one's a tricky one. 21 moves is all it needs. I'm not anywhere close to it. I guess we could try that. Oh, would I want to move that there? Would that give me any anything that I could work with? yellow block always in the way I need to find a way to move this up just one means I need to get one of these over here. It's easier said than done. One's a tough one. backwards and it's not really working so I'm gonna go back to this
That's not good. Not good. Actually. It is good. But I gotta find a way to get those purple blocks down there. Oh, never mind. Ah! <laughs> oh, okay. Sometimes it's kind of hard to think that far ahead, and I, I, I keep smacking this. Um, well done. Were you able to get the ball into the hole without shuffling too much back and forth? If you had to move the ball lots of times to reach the goal, don't worry. Figuring it out, figuring out how to get to the goal in the fewest moves possible is an interesting puzzle in itself. There we are. Come on, Luke. We must press on. All right, lead the way, Professor. Hey, Professor, there's something that's been on my mind for a while. Oh, what is it, Luke? When the crank for the bridge was stolen, we were sealed in the village along with Don Paolo. It could just be me, but I feel like this wasn't just a coincidence. Somebody planned it, but who? Well, Luke, I don't have any direct evidence of it, but I'd wager that it was Bruno's doing. Bruno? But why in the world would Bruno do something like that? You remember what he said? It's his duty to show the way to those who seek the golden apple. But naturally, Bruno had no idea what kind of people would come to Saint Mystery seeking that treasure. Likely he trapped us in the village to buy himself some time to evaluate who we were. He wanted to see if we were worthy of the secret. That's terribly presumptuous of him, don't you think? Very presumptuous of uh, Leighton as well. How could he think either of us were bad people? He doesn't even know us. Who knows how Bruno saw it, Luke? I'm certain he was just being careful. After all, Don Paolo managed to sneak in with us. Bruno probably had his hands full and needed time to see what kind of people had entered the village. Well, that reminds me, I wanted to ask about that too. Luke, we really should get started here. Uh, you can ask me your next question while we're climbing. Yeah. Punk. Alright, there's the crank. Uh, 